Buffalo in San Marino. We do admit to, however, very, very scenic things. And, and men in, in shining uniforms. <laughs> and, 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 and it's a wonderful place to get to. We have a train station only 16 miles away. <laughs> we have seven licensed taxi companies. And there will be cake and cake and cake. And <laughs> Hush. And now I come to the bit where I need to cheat and read from the, the words of uh, Lauren Shaw and I'll find a uh, bit chill. While San Marino, San Marino is indeed an interesting, quicker place, the real motivation behind our bit is to shine some light on the Capital Award for Best New Writer and the many brilliant authors who are past nominees. Everyone knows that the World Gone is the place where the coveted Hugo Awards are handed out, including those for fiction by the genre's finest writers, authors who are at the peak of their powers. There's much less fanfare for another prize presented that same night, the John W. Campbell Award for Best New Writer, not that a Hugo Award. <laughs> we think that this is a mistake, that there should be more noise made about this award every year. The list of nominees should be a blazing signpost of authors that fans should be watching, or better still, reading. And because the San Marino in 2019 World Conflict is all about audacity, when we're not about cake, we're doing something about it. Everyone who buys a supporting membership in the bin gets a free ebook, ebook entitled Cream of San Marino, Stories by Campbell Award nominees. And if that weren't enough, everyone who supports at any level above the bottom rung gets all the volumes in this series because there is just so much Campbell Award nominee awesomeness that one book couldn't hold it all. As of this writing, volume one has already gone live. We're debating volume two, three, volume four, we don't know.